Hi, it's Ryan Rhodes, and you're watching Pound for Pound Fighting Pride. Yeah, good, busy. Um, opened the gym at seven this morning and uh, been in all day training the fighters, uh, training keep fitters and just getting people ready. That's one, one of the things I wanted to ask you, man. How's life been from a professional fighter to now you're training other fighters? It doesn't hurt as much, trust me. <laughs> but no, it's a uh, it's a good thing. I mean, I'm I'm uh, I'm privileged that I can pass on a lot of my knowledge what I picked up when I was fighting in, inside them ring, inside that ring, um, and I feel I've got loads to pass on. I fought at every level uh, from from starting out to British title, European and world level. I was unfortunate never to win that world title, but. You know, I fought at that level, and, and that's what I feel I can pass on to all my fighters. How many um, pro fighters have you got under your belt now? I'm training probably about 11 or 12 pro fighters. Uh, I manage about five or six of them. Um, so, yeah, we're busy. We're getting more and more active, more and more busy. The gym is expanding now as well, isn't it? You're having some more gym as well. Yeah, um, yeah, we. Um, Literally, we out, outgrown this building massively. We've been here a year. Uh, we've got over 140, 150 members now, and we just we just outgrown it. Uh, so we found a new building, only 10 minute walk from this place. Uh, so yeah, bigger and better. Uh, the new the new gym gym's going to be bigger and better. Uh, when's the next uh, When's the next road road's, uh, fight bill coming? Uh, we've got a show on the 30th of uh, September. It's a Friday evening. Uh, it's at Bramall Lane, it's a Sheffield United football ground in their Platinum Suite. Um, five of our fighters are fighting from the gym. Uh, we've got uh, Jordan Kissack, uh, Nathan Yunus, both having their pro debut. Uh, we've got Adnan Amar, uh, joined me about four or five months ago, fighter from the Ingle Gym. Uh, we've got Chris Dutton having his third pro fight and we've got the, the comeback of Callum Hancock, who's been uh, inactive over the last uh, 18 months, but he's raring and ready to go now. So it's going to be a great show from the guys at 26RR. Yeah, there's been a lot, there's been a lot of great um, shows for British boxing right now. Like, what do you think about the British boxing scene right now? Getting bigger and better. You know, I think what we've got 13, 14 world champion British fighters. Uh, I don't think it's ever been known. Um, we've got some of the biggest, the biggest shows coming up. Uh, you've got Kelbrook fighting Golovkin, Triple G. Big, big fight for Britain. Uh, big fight for Kel, tough, tough fight. But it's a fight Kel can win, listen. Kel's Golovkin's best opponent, definitely. And obviously Golovkin's Kel's best opponent too. But it's a great fight. Um, you'd have to say Golovkin's the favourite, but believe me, it's a, it's a fight Kel can win. What do you think with all the talk with the weights and that? Do you think it matters that much? To be fair, people don't realise how big Kel is. He he comes down from 12 and a half, 13 stone. So he's going to be as, just as big uh, as Golovkin. Uh, Kel hits as, as as hard as any other middleweights out there. Uh, punches like, I know first hand Kel, what Kel punches like. So, you know, I know Golovkin's a big, big, big puncher and I'm not taking that away from him. Uh, he probably is going to be the big puncher. But he's not got the move and he's not got the speed uh, what Kel's going to bring to the table, so it's going to be a good fight. Yeah, excited to watch that one. Can't wait. Yeah, Sheffield, Sheffield fighters. Like we've, always, we've, always, we've always had like a good pool of fighters. Yeah, it's been like a conveyor, a conveyor belt through uh, from Sheffield fighters. Uh, Harold Graham, Johnny Nelson, uh, Brian Anderson to Naz, myself, uh, Junior Witter. Um, Kel Brook, uh, Kid Gallard, there's a conveyor belt full of Sheffield top, top fighters. Uh, I don't know what it is, must be something in the water in Sheffield, but it's forever we're turning great fighters out. Um, and we've got a lot of good fighters coming through. Just in my gym, I've got Samo Mason, uh, Callum Hancock, Chris Dutton, great fighters just getting on the scene. I've got the uh, NASA brothers, Lua and Ramsey. Um, you know, just to name a few, um, kids turning pro, uh, Jordan Kissack, Nathan Yunus, uh, Nikolai Campbell, Christian uh, Consona, um, 
we're getting busier and busier. I apologise if I've missed anybody out from down at the gym, but we're just getting busier and busier, and that's what Sheffield's all about, turning great fighters out. Is anybody really excited about from Sheffield like that's really looking like they're going to do damage in the future? Do you know, uh, I think Sam Mason's on the verge of of just fighting for that good title, fighting for that for the English title, if not fighting for that British title. Um, Callum Hancock, who's, who's unbeaten um, as, a, as a pro fighter, so do you know, it's it's we've got we've got great talent in Sheffield. Um, and we're forever turning great talent over. Uh, we've just got to make sure that they, they live right, they train hard, uh, and they do everything what the coaches tell them to do. And we'll be turning out more and more champions each, each time. You know, some people I speak to that want to get involved with boxing, whether for fitness or whether the fancy training pro, um, and that's like, how can we get in touch with gym so for yourself, what would be the best, best way to get involved? Do you know what, minute we're on London Road in Sheffield, we're moving to um, uh, the, the old kit locker building at uh, Shales Moor, um, not far from me, like I say, it's a 15 minute walk. You know, go to your local gyms and there's not another sport like it for fitness wise, there's not another sport like it for losing weight. Get yourself involved in boxing. Um, we've we've got members in our gym from from all all levels of fitness, from your keep fitters, uh, from your professionals, from from your ladies what want to come in and do boxer size classes to to like I said all the, all levels of fitness. If you want to lose weight, if you want to get fit, get involved in your local boxing gym. I advise it for anybody. No problem, wicked. Thank you. All right. Yeah.